boys and girls, what do I have today? Crayons. Not crayons. Pencils. pencils. Do y'all like pencils? No. Have you ever used? No, you must be in school. <laughs> have you ever used a pencil? Do y'all have pencils? Okay, well, every time you use a pencil, I want you to think about how we're kind of a little bit like pencils, okay? And what I'm going to tell you is the first of all, is this pencil does not have a point on it, okay? So it's pretty useless, isn't it? Because we can't write with it. So not very important for us to have a pencil if we can't write with it. That's right, okay? So what God does sometimes is he will, he will sharpen us with a sharpener to make a point. Now, is a pencil with a point, is that important? Can you write with it? That's right, okay? God wants us to make our mark in the world, but unless we are sharpened, then we can't make our mark. Well, sharpening boys and girls, have you ever stuck your, fi your finger, please do not do this at home, but have you ever stuck your finger in a pencil sharpener? It is sharp. You, I figured you had. I, just for some reason, I figured you had done that. But if you do that, it hurts. It could make your finger bleed. It hurts. And sometimes we have to go through some hurts in our lives, through some trials in our lives, but it makes us sharp to make us be able to make our mark. Well, I want you to look at this pencil. Look at my red pencil. What is it missing? The eraser. Well, what do you do with the eraser? You get marks off. Well, boys and girls, sometimes in life, we have sin in our lives, things that we said that we wish we had not said or things that we had done that we wish we had not done. Well, if, if you're writing, you can erase it. But if it's in our lives, we have to have some way to get rid of that sin. Well, boys and girls, Jesus came and he died on the cross to forgive us of our sin. So if we ask for our sin, our, our forgiveness from our sin, Jesus is like a big eraser. And he takes that sin and he puts that sin behind his back. And no matter which way he turns, that sin is behind his back. Jesus doesn't say, look what you did. I remember when you were mean to your brother or mean to your sister. He puts that sin and it's gone. He doesn't ever throw it out in front of us. Okay? So it's really, really important for us to be able to make our mark in the world. Now... Look at this pencil. What's the most important part of it? Is it the eraser? Or is it the outside of the pencil? What's the most important thing of the pencil? The inside of the pencil. Well, boys and girls, that's the same way with us. The most important thing is the, what's inside of us, especially when Jesus is in our heart. Boys and girls, you can look, and, and I've got pencils for all of you. Once we get upstairs, I'll give you all a pencil. But you can look and you can see there's different sizes and shapes and colors of pencils, just like there's different sizes and shapes and colors of us. But the most important thing is what's on the inside, especially when that's Jesus. Boys and girls, let's walk up real quietly to Children's Church.